Okay, so again, when we uh, create a list and we display the list and then we create a list from list one and then we modify list two, we're actually modifying list one. And we can see that from the output. This is this print statement here. And the last two outputs are list one and list two, but notice both of them have negative one. So if we go and look at the diagram we have a case where two variables are pointing or referencing the same list. So we need to make sure that we understand how that works. So if we want to copy lists, we have to do it what's called manually, right? We have to write the code to make that happen. So we go here, list one equals uh, one, two, three, four. And then we create an empty list. So we say list two. And how do we create an empty list? We say list equal to open close bracket. That's an empty list. Now we can loop through the list. So we can say for item or maybe for num in list one, list two dot append num. So now we create two different variables. And we will see that once we do that, we can say list2, value at index 0, change to negative 1. And actually, this should be list2, right? Ah, control Z. And then print list1, print list2. And let's go ahead and also make sure we print list1 up here, right? Here. Okay, so this is what's known as manual. Like we have to take ownership of iterating list one, copying each value to list two, and append the value. So let's go into main, and we call control space. Uh, we select manually this time, and we go ahead and notice now when we change the list we do not change both lists. We just change list one, which means that now we have the concept where we have in memory two different lists. So let me uh, copy this and we'll quickly trace that piece. So we go So we have that code and then we can draw some memory block. And we have one, two, three, four. Assuming this is this one memory block. So that's this one here. Okay. But then when this statement executes, actually this one here, we create a list. So assuming it chose this block for the list. And then we run through this piece here. And so then we'll have one, two, three, four. But this is now a variable list two. So list two is here. And now we do not have two variables pointing to the same list. So when I run this statement here, list two index zero change to negative one, we are changing this one. And this one up here, this one stays the same. So we are working with two different lists. So we need to make sure. We understand that piece there. Questions here? Okay, no question, so let me briefly